welcome to All You Music Hate Explorers. My name is James and I play the trumpet and it sounds a little like this. <laughs> I've chosen a beautiful piece of music for us to explore together today. Let's start by listening to the piece together. While you're listening, I want you to let your mind wander and let your imagination take over as you listen to the music. Think about what images pop into your mind. Are you ready? Let's listen. Wow, I really loved listening to that piece. It made me feel very calm. And whilst I was listening, I imagined a beautiful landscape with some light rain. 
This piece is called Nocturne in E-flat Major and was written by the Polish composer Federic Chopin. Chopin, who was born over 170 years ago, was actually an extremely talented piano player who first publicly performed when he was only seven years old. A nocturne is a piece of music about the night. I wonder if you noticed anything about the tempo or speed of the piece. I wondered if any of you noticed it changing. The pianist played the piece of music in a rubato style. Rubato is when a musician has the freedom to speed up or slow down. Just like when sp speaking, we can push the speed like this, or we can really pull it back. And this helps to change the mood and the emotion of the piece, just like with speaking. Now let's explore this on the trumpet. I'm going to play a piece that you'll all know. Firstly, the way you've heard it before, and then I'm going to play it rubato. <sighs> Now, rubato. Could you hear the difference? I find that playing rubato can make the song feel more dramatic and expressive. The nocturne's melody is really beautiful and filled with musical decorations. In music, we call this ornamentation. Ornamentation is when we play extra notes to make the music even more beautiful. Just like when you decorate a Christmas tree. Here are some decorations I like using. This one's a trill. And this one's called a turn. And this one's a chromatic run. Let's go back to Twinkle Twinkle Little Star and I'll add my favourite musical decorations. I thought it would be really nice if you listen to the nocturne again and draw a picture or write a short story or poem inspired by the beautiful music. This is what I imagined. I'm sitting by the river. It's early evening. The setting sun paints beautiful pictures in the sky. A soft wind glides along the surface of the water as the first stars show pinpricks of light against the darkening sky. The sun disappears completely the grand moon brightens and the soft breeze stops. The moon and the stars glow against the deep dark sky. The day is over and it is time to rest. I hope you all enjoyed listening to the Nocturne in E-flat major and writing your own story or drawing as much as I did. And next time you hear rubato or ornamentation in a piece of music, you can show off your knowledge to your friends and family. Bye for now.